Millions of adults are living with a common congenital heart defect called patent foramen ovale, or PFO. However, many are not even aware this defect exists. PFO occurs when an opening between the right and left upper chambers of the heart fails to close after birth. The remaining tunnel can potentially allow blood to flow between these chambers, and this could lead to medical conditions such as stroke. The vast majority of people never have any complications, but doctors believe some young adults may be at risk. And potentially patients who have had strokes or recurrent strokes despite adequate medical therapy and have a PFO are candidates for closure of the PFO. At Wake Forest Baptist Medical Center, cardiologists are now using a minimally invasive procedure to repair PFO. A catheter is inserted through the femoral vein in the leg, much like an angioplasty. Then a patch about the size of a quarter is advanced into the affected area of the heart. Once it's in the heart, we can use the catheter to cross the PFO, which essentially is a tunnel in the atrial septum or top chambers of the heart. Once we cross the tunnel, we can then deploy a special device that helps seal that tunnel and prevent blood flow between the top chambers of the heart. Oftentimes the patient goes to the holding room without any catheters in their body and then we'll watch them overnight and they can go home the next day. So it's really been a boon for patients who truly need this procedure for uh, significant clinical problems and it uh, saves them from undergoing an open heart procedure. On June the 6th at 5 p.m., Wake Forest Baptist surgeons will demonstrate the procedure in a live internet webcast, which will be archived for viewing anytime. This is Mark Wright in Winston-Salem.